So we're day two in Cologne, Germany. Yes, I'm wearing the same hoodie. Don't worry, I washed it. But I only really wore it for 15 minutes anyway. So um, yeah, day two. I'm about to go get something to eat in the morning and uh, we're actually going to be going to Gamescom today. So I uh, don't know if I'll be vlogging inside Gamescom because I want to have fun as well. Um, but at the same time, um, we are going to play a lot of games. So I'm not sure if I'll get them any recorded or anything like that or how much I can actually record. But right now I'm going to the restaurant just to get some breakfast and uh, then I'll be going to the shops to uh, get some food and some drinks for the rest of the games. So the restaurant was closed. But anyway, um, I'm gonna go to the shops and get something to eat instead. I really want a hot chocolate because I've got kind of a sore throat. Um, so it would have made sense to have a warm drink or maybe I can have a cup of tea at a hotel, I don't know. Um, but I will be getting a taxi soon and uh, that lighting was pretty good there. Wow, but I will be getting a taxi soon and um, take my way well, back to Gate well, First time to Gamescom actually. And uh, it's very exciting. I'm gonna meet a few people. Hopefully, gonna meet Best of Slot and Gaming Beaver. Um, so, see how they're doing. And uh, meet the developers of Frontier as well. And say a big thank you to them um, just for just for making the game really and uh, letting us play it earlier. <laughs> um, it's gonna be really fun. But um, yeah, don't know what's gonna go in this video. I don't even know if the rest of the video is even uploaded properly. Um, because I had uh, issues last night, I had issues this morning as well, so not the greatest. Um, but enjoy the rest of the video if you do see it. <laughs> so I ended up getting some Mentos because they're easy sweets and they keep the breath nice and minty or fruity, shall I say, in this essence. I also ended up getting um, a Powerade just in case I lose a bit of energy, get a bit of energy back, and uh, two bottles of water because I don't know how hot it's going to be um, at the moment. Hoodie's not, it's not, hoodie's not a good idea right now um, because it's quite hot in a way and uh, I'm worried I'm going to sweat too much. <laughs> I'm going to go back to the hotel now. I'm uh, going to go to the toilet and then I'm going to go, I don't think you really need this to know that, but then I'm going to go back down to the hotel reception and ask them to book a taxi and get a taxi to the Gamescom and uh, be my first ever time. I'm looking forward to it. Gamescom, I did the most English thing possible and get a McDonald's in a foreign country. So as a review of the McDonald's from Germany, uh, not as good as UK, um, besides the nuggets. The nuggets were quite good, they are crispier, everything like that. The milkshake was looks very different and tasted alright, but the burger let it down. The burger was a bit stale and it was very small. I was surprised that I could fit my order in that bag. In England you wouldn't get that, but um, all in all, I'm filled, I'm not hungry. So I'm walking back to um, my hotel now. Um, I chose to walk, it's an hour walk. Tiring, but um, these sights I'm getting right now, bloody gorgeous, they really are. Just looking over the bridge, looking at the Rhine River, brilliant. 
it's nice and my hair but um i'm going to quickly show you um the river and then i will continue talking about later on uh, exactly what happened during gamescom it's a very exciting thing that happened well to me personally but um yeah it was, it was quite a good time so i'll turn around now and show you the right river so we get to see sights like this when walking home it really does look amazing, especially with the like sunset in the background. You have the, as my taxi driver was once saying, when you have the old um, section of Cologne over there, and over on that side you have the more modern day section. Here we zoom in, there you can see the new modern buildings, which I've never seen designs like that before. Okay, um, when that bus went by, you can feel the whole bridge shake. So uh, I'm going to get off this bridge as soon as possible, um, but in the meantime, just looking at this gorgeous city. So uh, what happened at Gamescom? Well, in a quick overview, um, of what I was essentially doing was playing the games, and uh, it was a lot of fun. I played Kana Zoo, met up with Bo and Shante, which actually helped me out a lot. Big shout out to actually Bo from Frontier, um, who actually allowed me to get a, a VIP pass to skip the queues, go to the front. I know it's a dick move, but um, yeah, it was it was quite nice. So I didn't. What is this piece of hair doing? But yeah, it was quite nice because I didn't actually have to spend um, two two hours in a queue, <laughs> which. It was quite a long time. I was going to go play the Call of Duty Modern Warfare as well, um, but that's about five, six hours waiting in the queue. Everybody had their um, sort of chairs out and they had food, and I made the mistake of that. So it uh, wasn't really the greatest, um, but um, hopefully I'm going to go in tomorrow morning and um, then continue vlogging, hopefully play um, the new Call of Duty Modern Warfare as well. Um, definitely exciting part because if you guys don't know, my roots are originally uh, from Call of Duty, but uh, yeah. Again, just look, look how, oh, I really love the city. Look how incredible it looks at night. It really does look amazing. I'm in love with it. Even over there, the same thing. It just looks really, really nice on the modern part. So what happened at Gamescom? Um, basically, we all know that um, people are live streaming Planet Zoo, getting their game hands on early. And um, that was the main point of uh, big YouTubers going. And um, it was quite nice to see Best of Slot. And what is this piece of hair doing as well? Why is it always annoying? But it was quite nice to also see Best of Slot and also uh, James, or Game and Beaver, shall I say. Um, I was lucky enough to spend a whole day with him, which thank you very much if you are watching this, um, because that really meant a lot. It was nice to have some company because I'd have been on my own for the majority of the time. So uh, it was quite nice to spend time with one of the YouTubers I've been watching for years now. And uh, it goes to show that if you, if you pers persevere and what you want to do, eventually it will work out and it was nice to meet uh, Gaming Beaver it really was um, simply because he's a really chill guy he allowed me managed to get me into the business section which was uh, quite a good thing as well and um, I was very happy about that we went to see this new dinosaur game that's been developed which uh, actually looks quite good so I'll probably keep you in touch about that and um, make a few videos on it but in the meantime um, it was really nice we managed to eat together we managed to just throw about and uh, take a look at Gamescom together, which I thought was a really nice touch. It was really nice to spend time with a YouTuber I watched for quite some time, and I don't know, just really hang out with him, and it was a really nice thing to do. First day at Gamescom, really well done. It, it was great, it really was. I don't know how much you've actually seen. Um, I did try to live stream, but obviously, just look at look at that view. I've used them, that's, that's the main thing why I'm here. <laughs> That's, that's the whole reason why I wanted to walk because even coming from the airport straight to my hotel we went over this river to then show us and I was able to look at the city which was quite a cool thing to do and um, I'm very excited that I am here because look at it that's the views I get it's incredible um, but in the meantime I'm going to walk back to my hotel and probably catch up with you guys right there I'm finally at my hotel run up two flights of stairs have to go down another one so Fun. There we go. And we have light. Ich habe jetzt zu Hause. Mach dich gut. Ich sage, dass du 
So just like that, I'm back in England and I'm currently waiting for my bag. Is that my bag? No, it's not my bag. Is it my bag? I don't know. Um, but I'm currently waiting for my bag and I think this is actually it, so I'll be right back. So it turns out it was my bag, but um, yeah, back in England now and um, I'm going to go home and maybe edit all of this together. I'm not sure when it's going to be up because I think I have an embargo on it. So uh, I'll let you guys know when that's going to be up. But uh, yeah, back in England, amazing time in Germany and uh, we'll be updated about that.